out here with the X Max. This thing's pretty much stock. It does have a few upgrades. I've got the Hobby Wing Max 6 ESC. I'm running some hot racing hardened pinion and spur gears. I'm running a 24 tooth pinion gear and a 46 tooth spur gear on the stock motor, which is plenty fast. I have some aftermarket RWC shocks. Um, nice aluminum touch there. I have some RPM hub carriers in the rear and some Entogy hub carriers in the front. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. So this thing is the king of all bashing. Also, I've got this Dark Side Studios wrap. Looks amazing. I do need to shoot good. It did take a little bit of damage last bash. But uh, yeah, let the beast rip. <laughs> And she still lives, guys. That's why the X Max is the toughest truck on the planet. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. body took a good hit. Yes, it did. X Max still going. Oh, the classic X Max body falling off on the landings. You gotta love it. I used to have a Velcro strap on here, which is kind of cool. I need to put that back on to keep that body from doing that. The X-Max is so gnarly, y'all. The body just can't hang. It's about right. Oh, that was off axis. She takes it.
All right, guys, so that was one heck of a bash. This thing took a flogging like nothing I've ever seen. Uh, no damage, of course. It's an X Max, right? It's an upgraded X Max. Y'all saw the slams to concrete, you saw everything. Other than the body, the body took one hell of a beating, always. But the X Max is fine. Time to go for the Outcast. Hopefully the Outcast can hold up to that. I don't know any RC that can hold up to what I just saw with the X Max. All right, so it's the next morning, and I'm out here at the same spot, same location, same ramp. Arma Outcast 8S. This is my build. This is the EXB version of the truck. I put a Hobbywing Max 5 ESC. I have a Spectrum 1100 Firma 1/5 kV brushless motor. I have, you know, two Yumi batteries, the same batteries as running the X Max 8S, and everything else is stock, guys. So let's see how long it lasts. Let's rip it. Yeah, my gearing is a uh, Saga Customs pinion gear. That is a 31 tooth and a 39 tooth spur. Well, it's a little bouncy in this grass, guys, but it sure is nice on the truck. She's still taking it. That was a massive jump guys I'm actually very impressed I, I can't believe this rig took that seriously that was crazy It's a beast! Look at that thing go, guys. It's an animal. It's 
just tears it up. All right, so I just took the lid off to check my temps. Motor's pretty warm, but everything is perfect. Uh, the bracing's perfect. The chassis looks perfect. Uh, that was a crazy slam to the concrete there from like 50 feet up, and this truck has just been a beast. It just took it. So I'm very impressed, Arma. Way to go. That does not sound good. Look at that drive shaft. That was a clobber, guys. That was terrible. I did not mean to do that. No RC could take that. That's it for the outcast. Front. Yeah, that's bent. That's bent. How about the rear? Rear's not too bad. I'm amazed the arm didn't snap on that. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that toe link there. She's done. I don't know about my servo. Something's going on. Oh, I see. Yeah, that blew off. That's the end of that, guys. Well, she did put up a good fight. I have to give it to her. The Outcast 8S, man. That, that was a terrible slam. Just hit the ramp off access. There was no saving that, guys, whatsoever.